Hey everyone, it is Monday, December 3rd, and it's cold out here. Cold, cold, cold. It's 30 something below this morning. All right, I am going to do show you this wig. Um, it is a Vivica Fox deep lace front. This is Fergie V in 2216. And that's the package that it came in. And this is the wig. If I can find it. <clears throat> Excuse me. So this is the 2216 in Fergie. I have discovered that different, um, it smells good. It smells like my perfume. That different wigs have different blends, even if it's Vivica Fox. One thing about this one though, is that it's a little thin in the back. I noticed so you have to be careful I paid oh 30 35 dollars for it maybe now <clears throat> as I said um, the back here is a little thin and I have found that to be true with some of her wigs this is quite long I'm gonna have to cut it because it's too long for me but I like the um, the dark color on the bottom and then how it's all kind of woven in with the other color <clears throat> now this is a lace front it has the deep V and um, it's a, the deepest in the mid part um, here in the and it goes um, ear to ear or temple to temple the lace does it has three combs in the front and it has one in the back under the tag. One thing that I wish uh, Vivica Fox would do would be to put the name of the wig inside because I get confused. Although I guess, you know, it really doesn't matter. And if I store it in the pack, then who cares? So I'm going to go ahead and put this on. And when these come, there is about this much lace that you have to trim off and it has a scalloped edge. The lace is kind of hard and scratchy, but I'd say it's no worse than the expensive Raquel Welsh lace. So, so just brush it out a little bit. This has really pretty waves. Oh, I got that there. And is this the one that I cut little baby hairs in? One of them I did. And here are the curls. But as you can see, this is just too long for me. And uh, this is the future of fiber, so I can um, use heat up to... Oh, this has naturally embedded baby hairs. And no one will know you're wearing a wig, even you. Futura... What does it say? Curling iron safe. It's up to 300 and I think 92 degrees or something random like that. I'm like, whose hot tool has increments of one on it? Nobody that I know of. So this is what it looks like. And I have it parted here because that's where I part mine usually. But you can part it in the center. And if you part it in the center, the lace goes back the farthest. So you can do that. Actually, that's not bad. I kind of like that. I think I kind of like that better than the side part. I don't know. I'll have to... I'm looking in the mirror behind the camera, so that's why I'm not looking at you a lot. So this is what the lace is like. It does come with um, some tape. Let me pull some of this stuff out. I was hoping these would come with it boxes, but I've only gotten one um, in a box. It has the Vapon tape, a couple of pieces, and it's Futura Curling Iron Safe. And this is the hang tag if you're putting it on a mannequin in the store. And in here they give you instructions on how to apply and take care of the wig. Curling Iron. 
For curling, set your iron between 356 and 392 degrees. What's with the six and the two? Anyway. So, this is what the lace looks like. It does have ear tabs. Um, and here is the left side. And the back. And maybe you can... Can you see here how it's a little thin and just kind of have to be careful and there's the length and on this side i think the color on this is really pretty i think it's very well done there is like permatease kind of at the nape here um, but i think that um, for the price, Vivica Fox does a really nice job with her wigs. The hair is a real nice quality. I have not applied heat um, at all. And um, I like the, the, I actually do like the piano um, highlights and lowlights in this. I do like how they're done. I mean, they're, they're chunky, but they look... I'm not going to say natural, but it looks like a style that you would get in the salon. So, and I'm sure this will tangle up easily just because it is super long. But, there you go. And I do not use the combs. The cap is one of the best fitting caps that I have ever encountered. They really are very nice fitting. I haven't adjusted it at all. I'm, in fact, I'm not even sure what um, the adjustable strap is set on. I haven't touched it. And um, they're very snug. There's still a little room in here because I don't have much hair, but the cap is very snug and comfortable. And I think these are really nice. I got, um, you can see here kind of where the weft start back here behind the lace. It's kind of lumpy almost looking. But um, I got these off of Mimi Beauty line. So, and if you sign up for their emails, you will get um, emails with discount codes. And uh, their prices are really good anyway. They have some of the best prices. And you can always call them too and ask if they have a particular um, style and color. And there's Juno. Hi, Juno. Hi, sweetie pie. She may have to go out. So, all right. Well, this is my review of Fergie from Vivica Fox. And it is in the P2216. And thanks for watching, you guys. I'm going to do another one after I let Juno out. I'll, I'll be right back. Bye.